are watching this video from justutors.com. In this video, we are going to learn about laws of exponents for real numbers. But before moving to our today's topic, we will try a warm up question. So, here are the questions for you. To try this warm up question, you can pause the video. So, basically, as you can see, that in question number one, you need to first solve a part so which is 5 to the power 3 times 2 to the power 3 so as you can see that the power is same and the base is different so you put the power here and it's 5 times 2 which is 10 so 10 raised to the power 3 is equals to 1000 the next is 6 cube which is equals to 216 now we move ahead to our topic which is about laws of exponents. So first we'll recall some basic rules of laws of exponents. So first of all, if it is p to the power m times p to the power n, this is equal to p to the power m plus n. So if it is like 2 to the power 3 times 2 to the power 5, this is equal to 2 to the power 3 plus 5, which is equal to 2 to the power 8. The next is p to the power m, 2 to the power n is p to the power m n. So if it is 2 to the power 3, 2 to the power 5. So this would be 2 to the power 5 times 3 which is 15. The next is p to the power m, p to the power divided by p to the power n equals p to the power m minus n. So it is 2 to the power 5 divided by 2 to the power 3. This is equals to 2 to the power 5 minus 3 which is equals to 2 to the power 5 minus 3 is 2. The next is p to the power m, q to the power m. As you can see that here, the exponents are same and base are different. So if it is like 2 to the power 3 times 3 to the power 3, this is equals to pq, which is 2 times 3, which is 6, to the whole power 3. The next is p to the power 0. If there is any constant, any variable raised to the power 0, if it is like 2, 3, 1, 5, 9. This whole raised to the power 0. The answer is fixed, which is 1. And the next is if p to the power minus n, it is about negative exponent, so it's 2 to the power minus 3. This is equals to 1 over 2 to the power 3. So these are the some basic laws of exponent. Now we'll try some questions on that. Here are the questions for you. To try these questions, you can pause the video. So the answer for these questions would be 2 raised to the power 1 over 3 plus 4 over 3 which is equal to 2 raised to the power 5 over 3. The next is 7 raised to the power 2 over 5 times 7 which is 7 raised to the power 14 over 5. The next is 7 raised to the power 3 fifths minus 1 over 5 which is equal to 7 raised to the power 2 fifths. The next is 4 times 3 which is 12 raised to the power 2 thirds. Now these are the answers of the questions. Now we move ahead and we are going to learn some new laws of exponent which says if n nth root of a number equals number to the power 1 over n. Say if it is cube root of say it's 5. So this would be 5 over 1 third. The next law says if it is 5 to the power 2 over 3, we can write it as 3 under root 5, which is cube root of 5 whole raised to the power 2. This is equal to cube root of 5 square. Now here are some examples for you. It is cube root of 8 equals 8 raised to the power 1 third which is equals to 8 is 2 cross 2 cross 2 so this is 2 to the power 3 so we can write 2 to the power 3 in place of 8 and that would be 2 the next is 32 to the power 2 fifths which is fifth root of 32 whole raised to the power 2 which is equal to fifth root of 2 to the power 5 since 32 is equal to 2 to the power 5 and we can write one more step here it would be fifth root of under root 
2 and 5 times 2 which is equals to 10 which is equals to 2 10 over 5 which is equals to 2 square so the answer is 4 and there is another method of solving the same question you can do it in this way as well now we move ahead and now we are going to learn about some practice questions you need to use these laws to solve the questions so here are the practice questions for you to try these questions you can pause the video now here comes the answers you can match the answers and you should pat your back as you're working really well in understanding new laws of exponents thank you for watching the video for more please visit justutors.com